Welcome to this special edition of Frequency Matters. I'm Gary LaRude from Microwave Journal, and I'm here with Brian Goldstein, who's the general manager of the Aerospace and Defense Business Unit at Analog Devices. Brian, thanks for joining us. Well, thank you, Gary. Certainly the phased array architecture, the active phased array, has been a dramatic change in radar systems over the last 20 or 30 years, and I assume that's a market opportunity for analog devices going forward? Absolutely. Um, you know, our breadth of portfolio is having a major impact in the, w in the direction that technology is going. Uh, you know, as you know, the new architectures are driven around the high-speed converters and transceiver technologies. Right. And our, our silicon technologies are, are really driving the simplification of these architectures and combine that with our RF microwave uh, in the area of beam-forming core chips, in the area of GAN, transmit, receive, functionality and you can see how we're going to help revolutionize the phased array technology uh, in the not too distant future. This market was once dominated by the tier one defense companies right. and these, this technology was very, very expensive. Mm -hmm. uh, but with the uh, advent of uh, the integrated silicon, the high speed converters, the, our integrated transceiver chips, we're able to really drive down the cost and really simplify the architectures. You can basically put a high-speed converter at every element of the array, and, and our customers are able to envision themselves doing some very, very interesting things in both the military and civil applications. It's an area where the commercial world, uh, in terms of automated, automotive radar, has helped and dri drive down some of the silicon costs. The right. military has developed the GAN, and together there's been a real interesting synergy between our commercial work and our military work, helping both sides advance the technology. The work that's being done in 5G is absolutely paralleling the work that we're doing mm -hmm. in uh, military and civilian radar. Well, this seems like a really fascinating time to be involved in the defense market, and uh, it's going to be quite disruptive over the next uh, decade or so, and you're, you and your team are right in the sweet spot of it. Absolutely. Uh, we see the government spending their money on advancing the state of the art of the electronics pieces of their uh, military portfolios, and we're absolutely right in the middle of it, starting at the components, moving to the system level applications, and then ulti ultimately being a complete solution provider. Mm -hmm.